Hey everybody, I hope you guys are out there and safe. So some of you guys have probably heard of the term digital nomad. It refers to a person who does his work remotely off a laptop, meaning he doesn't have to go into a set office and work set nine to five hours. And even though I think the term digital nomad is a little bit cringeworthy, I actually fit that description to a T, at least before COVID. Before COVID, I used to travel all around Asia and just do all my work at random spots in, in Shenzhen, in Shanghai, in Tokyo, in Barcelona. So basically my laptop was everything, all my work, came off of that. And even though I really like the versatility of the lifestyle, working off a small laptop screen, just one laptop screen, can be a little bit restricting. All of you who have two screen setups at your home or office will probably agree 100%. You can just get more done when you have an extra screen or even two extra screens. And that's why I've always been a fan of two screen devices like the LG Wing and the Microsoft Duo. So anyway, today's video is about the Z-Back try screen two and as the name implies yeah it adds two more screens to your laptop to give it a total of three screens let's check out the unboxing first because i actually think the unboxing experience is pretty cool so if you look at the sides of the box you see that there are these tabs made out of cloth you grab onto them and you pull and it opens up so i like this this is designed to resemble the experience of pulling out the screens which we'll check out later you have a get started guide here, so in case you don't know how to set it up, scan the QR code and it will take you to instructional videos. But it's pretty easy to set up, it's really self-explanatory. And here's the Zbeck tri screen. So let's put it to the side first and look at what else is in the box. So I have to be honest, I've already unboxed this already. So I know what's in here, but I just wanted to show you guys the experience. So right here, you have a bunch of cables and accessories because the TriScreen 2 is designed to work with just about any laptop. So with some laptops, you'll need more cables than others. Fortunately, if you have a MacBook Pro, you don't need much. You only need two USB-C cables, which they provide right here. Type-C to Type-C cables. We have here a Type-C extension. So if for some reason these cables aren't long enough, you can always extend it. Okay, now you look on the left side. Okay, now on the left side, you have a, an HDMI to mini HDMI cable. This is another one, HDMI to mini HDMI. So if you have an older laptop that stores an HDMI port, then this is what you will use. You have two USB-A to USB-C adapters. So these are for older laptops without a USB-C port. And you have an elbow extension. So this is yet another USB-C extension that basically turns the plug sideways. So for some reason, if your laptop has, has really tight space, then you can plug this extension in to get a little bit more wiggle room in terms of where your cables go. Okay, so here's the Z-Beck Tri-Screen 2. The whole thing is crafted on mostly plastic to keep the weight down. So it weighs only two pounds, like this whole thing, two pounds. And it's about one inch in thickness. Now you flip it around the front, you see these elastic bands here. This is what allows the Z-Back Tri-Screen 2 to snap onto any laptop. So let me set it up on my 16-inch MacBook Pro with all USB-C ports, so I only need to use a Type-C to Type-C dongle. So I just have to pull and clip it onto the laptop like so. Now on the back here, you see there's a little kickstand. You will need to use the kickstand because, you know, this thing weighs two pounds, so you can't just have it hang off your laptop like that without any support. So you open up the kickstand, it will prop up the screen. Once the kickstand is on, it's really sturdy and stable. Then from here, you just pull from the sides to pull off the screen. Now these screens have a hinge that can rotate 180 degrees. Just tilt it a little bit towards yourself. This is a good angle. And then you just have to plug in these type C cables. So there are ports down below of each screen. So just simply plug it in, plug into your laptops screen turn on your macbook while you're at it yep it is now powered on now if this is your first time setting up you may have to go to display preferences to set up the monitors because the computer has to know where the screens are in relation to your screen so let's go to arrangement just like that it is now set up so now i should be able to drag windows to the right and now i have a proper multi-screen setup now this is very useful for my work because a lot of times i have to have slack open 
while I have another window open for Word document and then a third window open to keep track of Twitter, stuff like that. So just having three screens just make it so much easier. I don't have to keep cycling through the screens. This is super useful when I'm editing videos too because now I can just have the video playing in one screen and keep my main screen showing the timeline for me to make the cuts and edits as I need. Now these screens measures 10.1 inches diagonally with a resolution of 1920 by 1080. So they're more than sharp enough. Maximum brightness is okay. They're not the brightest screens around, but definitely more than usable indoors. If you are using this at the beach, you might struggle a little bit on a really sunny day. But for the most part right now, the left screen is only at 50% brightness and you can still see everything pretty well. Let's go up to max brightness. You can also adjust temperature, all of that down here. There are these menu buttons up top. And then at the bottom of the screen are two USB-C ports and one mini HDMI port. So if you have an older laptop that doesn't have a USB-C port, but it has an HDMI port, then that's the cable that you plug into. The ZBAC TriScreen 2 also supports pass-through charging. That means the USB-C cable that you use to charge your laptop, if you plug into the TriScreen 2's uh, port right here, it will also charge your laptop. So I like how easy it is to set up the TriScreen 2. It really takes less than 20 seconds to clip the thing onto my laptop, pull the screens out, plug in the cable. Now I also tried the ZBAC TriScreen 2 on my Huawei Mate X Pro 2021 edition. Unfortunately, that laptop only has one USB-C port on the left side. And on the right side is a low power USB-A port. So I could not get two screens working on that laptop. Instead, I can only get one screen working. But even having one extra screen is still better than having none. When you're done using everything, just simply unplug the cable and then close the screen back in. And then you can even close the laptop with the ZBEC staying on and just carry your entire thing like this. Now I gotta be honest, the MacBook 16 inch is pretty heavy and big as it is. So when you put the ZBEC TriScreen 2 on top of it, it does make it quite bulky and quite heavy now. Now this thing is like close to five, six pounds, but it can still fit into your backpack. Now it's not gonna be fun lugging this around all day, traveling around all day, but if I'm just going to a coffee shop in my neighborhood that I know is only like a five minute walk, then it's not bad. I can put this in my backpack and bring it with me. And it's small enough that I can set up on even a tiny tray table like this. And Hong Kong coffee shops have really small tray tables, so I can definitely get this up and running in most Hong Kong coffee shops. So ZBEC is selling the TriScreen 2 for 499 US dollars. Now, some of you guys are gonna think 499 is a little bit expensive because you can definitely buy a thin monitor for around $150 for one. So that means you can get two for $300. But you have to remember, those do not have the kind of clever clip on design the ZBEC try screen too. So, you know, I used one of those before. If you want to set it up next to your laptop, you need more table space to put it down right next to your laptop. So you have to factor in that ZBEC did come up with a pretty ingenious design in that you don't need more table space to set up the two screens. And the whole thing is a little bit more easier to carry because it is one piece. Because like I said, you can attach the TriScreen 2 to your laptop just like this and walk anywhere, go anywhere, knowing you have two screens ready to go at all time. I mean, you can even set this up on your lap if you want to. I mean, you'd have to put the kickstand against your knee, which might be weird. You cannot do that if you buy two separate screens separately, unless you plan on propping it onto the sofa like this. So yeah, that's about it for this video. If you're interested in more content like this, please consider subscribing to my channel or follow me on Instagram at Ben's Gadget Reviews. Thanks for watching.